this is Stampy, and welcome to another Let's Play on... And this is part number two of the uh, 100 Mario Challenge Expert Edition. That's right, I'm putting myself through this again. If you saw the last episode, then, um, sorry. <laughs> it's difficult. It's really, really difficult, this challenge. Like, really difficult. It's, it is an expert challenge for a reason. But I didn't give up. And I was able to complete, well, I completed like two courses, I think. Uh, there we go. I got two courses down and I got 74 lives remaining. So, uh, yeah, let's uh, let's carry on where we uh, where we picked off. And uh, let's see if I can complete. Here's my challenge. My challenge is to complete, well, my challenge is to complete all the levels. But my personal challenge uh, is to, to complete three levels this episode. So rather than uh, than two, I'm going to see whether I can uh, complete three of them, uh, which will be, uh, uh, yeah, better than I did uh, in the last episode. Now, I'm going to try and not skip too many. Uh, but really... When I have levels like this, like what am I supposed to do here? Like a lot of oh, okay, right. And so we got a uh, a hidden block level. Okay, I want to be careful because these guys keep uh, attacking me here. Uh, if I kind of just jump over them, they might actually be able to to help me if I'm able to like jump on them. Uh, but it looks like I need to keep heading up this way. Okay, I've kind of got myself a, a little bit of a, a platform here. Uh, so I guess I need to keep doing this. This is where things are going to get dangerous, though, because if I jump anywhere... Oh! <laughs> I was going to say, if I jump anywhere further to the uh, the right, then I'm going to start... Yeah, I'm going to start getting over the, the booze. So, uh, okay, so... Oh, wait a minute. There's a star. That might make things a bit easier. Right, let, let's go. Oh, the star's coming back as well. Can I just, can I just get the... Oh, oh, it hit that block there again. Right, if I stand here and try and get that star uh, when it shows up. Now it's going to make things a whole bunch easier. Oh no, the star's gone. Okay, let's try completing it this way again. But if I fail, you know, I always know there is a star there that I could go and just try and get it that way instead. Because what I think I might need to do is bounce on top of the uh, uh, the bullet bills and uh, jump over the booze that way. Let me see if I can get that other platform. There we go. I was able to get that other platform safely. So I might be able to jump off. Oh, okay, I died anyway. <laughs> Right, forget that. Uh, let's go. Let's go and try and just get that star then, because that that seems to be the way to do it. Forgetting all of these other platforms. Uh, so where's the star? The star's like here. Oh, I missed it. Okay, it will bounce back though. And if I'm kind of just ready for it this time, uh, that should make things easier. So I want to be just standing around here. And there we go. I got the star. And there we go. That was a <laughs> that was much easier. Oh, that's not the that's not the end of the level yet. There yet though. I don't know why. I just kind of assumed that that was going to be the entire level. But it's not. That is that is just the beginning. Okay, let's not start celebrating too early. Let's see if I can get that star first time. Oh, I just missed it there. It's okay, though. Because I know it's going to be heading back, and uh, time doesn't uh, really seem to be much of a factor here. Jumping into giant ghosts is a factor, though. Look at this. Already down to us. There's 70 lives left already. That's like four gone just just already now. Let me get that star. Oh, it's really tricky uh, to get that star straight away. Let's just try and be careful of these uh, these bullet bills and then the uh, the booze as well. And I uh, get this star. So I kind of jumped through some of the uh, there was some like some fwomps down there, and I jumped straight through them. So I guess uh, well, how am I supposed to do this then? Uh, can I get over here somehow? Maybe I'm gonna be able to. Oh no! Oh, this isn't good. Hmm. Okay. How am I going to? Do you reckon I can jump? So see where those like spinning fire trap things were? Do you reckon I can jump from there all the way to the, the other side? I might be able to. And there we go. At least I was able to get the, the star. Because if I kind of go like this and then go down to the, the left and then go like that. Oh no, I just jumped up to here. I need, I need to jump to that, that lower platform somehow. But I've now run out of, uh, of this. I wonder if there's anything else up there. Uh, I, I don't think there is. I, I thought I might be able to jump off those bullet bills in order to get higher up there. Uh, but I don't, I don't know if there's anywhere that I can get up to up there, if that makes sense. I don't know if there's if there's any anywhere where I can grab onto. And there's, there's no way to, like, duck under those, is there? Oh, actually, you know those like, little spinny moves? What about if I jump out and then keep spinning and get back the, the other way? That might be a way. I don't, I don't want to skip it yet. I'm, I'm feeling, I keep feeling close to wanting to skip it, but I feel, I feel like that is accepting defeat too early. But like, if I spend a lot more attempts on this level and keep losing lives, but don't end up like winning, then that's kind of just like a lot of lives wasted for no reason, if that makes sense. So what if I kind of, what if I kind of jump down like this and then keep, I oh, don't no, I'm not spinning. Oh, I didn't spin. Oh, was it because I had the heart mode? 
was trying to do, you know, the thing where you spin, but I was kind of doing like front flips instead. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's because I had the, um, maybe it's because I was sprinting. I was trying to do that move, but it, uh, it didn't let me for some reason. Maybe it's because I was sprinting. Uh, maybe I should try just jumping or maybe you don't do it when you have the star. Let's work this out. I'm not, I'm really not a Mario expert uh, at all. Yeah, no, so I can do this spin move. I think it was because I was sprinting. So let's do this and then, oh no, oh no, it's not doing it again. Oh, look, there we go. Oh, look at this. Oh, look, okay, okay. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Oh no, what was that? Oh, the very last second, a piranha plant came down. I don't know what I did there, though. I don't I don't know what I did to get to that point. <laughs> I just kind of went a little bit crazy for a while. Right, let's go and get this uh, this next star, and let's have uh, another go. So I kind of went like like this, and then I went, oh, I need to like jump, and then spin, 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 spin. Oh, I didn't. For some reason, I was able to jump off one of them. Wasn't I? I was able to hit one and kind of jump off it for some reason, but I don't know. I don't know how I did it. Like I've not, I've not played any of the uh, the games, like the uh, the the Wii U versions, or any of kind of the the free, well, kind of the the three D two D versions of the games. Like I've not played any of them, so I, I don't I don't know how all of these these new moves work. Like I'm very good at running and jumping. I can run and I can jump, but all like the wall jumping stuff and like these spin moves. I know they've been in the game for a while, but I'm just I'm just not very good at them. So let's try and do this again. So I kind of want to jump down and then spin like that, but oh, I can't jump off it again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is really frustrating. So I think that maybe rather than jumping to that that platform, if I just go underneath, because I kind of jumped off the wall, then I was able to like, I was able to hit one of the fonts for a second. I kind of just wish I could go back and watch what I did again. You can, because you're watching the, the video version. Oh, there we go. And then look, oh, I can't... And that was that was almost it, but I just I just couldn't quite do it. Maybe, maybe if I what I'm gonna try is I'm gonna try and go over you know like the the fire trap place. I'm gonna try that again, but try and just jump, but like not as high, and like maybe do this spin. Maybe if I jump from all the way back here and then go like that. Uh, oh, there we go. That was all that. Okay. M maybe if I jump and then jump off one of the bullet bills or something. Ugh, I don't know. But look, down to sixty lives already. There's no chance I'm gonna make this. Uh, oh, no chance if I play like that. There's no chance I'm going to make this a uh, uh, 100 Mario Expert challenge like this go, is there? there? There's no way. The fact that I'm down to like 59 lives. <laughs> and you know, this is my first go. Can I like... So what, what's going to be the strategy then? If I go, let's try this again. And if I go like that... Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, now I want to run. Now I want to run. Is this the end? That's not the end. Okay. What What's this? Oh, no. These are boos. Oh, these are a lot of boos. Okay. Well, it's fun to get to this point. I feel like I should have just kept on running. <laughs> if I keep, if I run low, is there anything else that way? Oh, can I even do this? Is this even possible? I'm, I'm pretty sure that what, what's coming up here isn't even possible. Um, are these gonna help me at all? Cause I, I can't get rid of booze with other, other enemies, can I? No, I, I don't. I think I just needed to keep on running. Uh, I guess if I just kept on running down the, the bottom uh, as quick as I could, I could have been able to, to make it. Well, that, that was promising. See, the problem is I, I was able to succeed. But I still don't exactly understand what it is that, uh, that I did in order to be able to succeed. I'm just kind of pressing all the buttons. I just kind of get to that area and I just press all the buttons really quick. And then I just hope that <laughs> it in some way ends up being good. I just hold to the right of the screen and just, you know, press lots of things and just hope that I eventually end up making it over there. So, let, oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. That was it. That was it. Okay. So, I think I just need to time that spin. But then, okay. Right. So, it looks like I do need to head up. I guess. Because I guess if I use the star, I can get through those other enemies. And then there was kind of that gr uh, the, not green, the uh, the blue uh, platform there. And then it looked like I'd be able to jump on. Right, so let's stand here. Then let's keep spinning. Like, oh, no, that's it. That's it. Oh, okay. I think it is. I think it's if you use that spinning move on the thwomps, you're able to jump off them. So rather than trying to get straight to that platform, let's try and land on one of those thwomps. And uh, let's go and, uh, and give that a go. Luckily, the difficult bit is right at the, uh, the beginning. And oh, it didn't work that time. Was my timing off? Or was my, my theory wrong? Well, let's, I'm going to not try spinning until I get right down uh, to that first swamp. And remember, even though I'm losing lots of lives, once I complete this level, I will get three lives back, which I know doesn't seem like much. But then, of course, it's kind of the same for any other levels. So why didn't it do it then? Sometimes I could just bounce off them, but I just don't know what it is that I do to enable me to do that. And sorry if you're like a Mario expert and should be the one doing this challenge, not me. <laughs> and this is infuriating you, but I just don't. It's just not clear to me what what I'm doing, which is allowing me to sometimes bounce off the uh, the thwomps and sometimes not. Because it seemed to be that spinning move. I just don't know. Should I? Do I need to already be doing the spinning move? Because there, I was doing the spinning move then, 
but I just kind of went through the the thwomp instead. All right, looks like um, looks like I'm back to my old strategy of just pressing all the buttons and holding to the right. Let's well, let's try doing holding sprint as well this time. So I'm going to hold sprint at the uh, the same time and then keep holding to the the right as well. And what is it with all of those in, invisible blocks as well? Because seeing as there's a star right there, they don't really they don't really seem necessary. Right, let's go like this and keep going. Oh, I can't do. It. So I need to be super quick as well. Because if I'm not quick then I'm going to lose my star, and I think that I need it for that later on section. So I've really got to be uh, as fast as I can, I think. I am getting a little bit close, I will be honest, uh, to really thinking about skipping it. Uh, so let's go like this. Come on, go, go, jump. Oh, it didn't go up. Okay, let's, say, let, let's set a hard limit. Let's say a hard limit of three more attempts, including this one. Okay, and if I don't make it then, then I'm going to have to skip. Okay, that, that was an attempt. That was one of the attempts. I got two more attempts now. I know that was a rubbish attempt because otherwise I'm just going to lose all of these lives and it's just game over. So uh, luckily though, uh, because I do have the ID, like I can go back and play this level in the uh, the future and try and probably work out what it is. But trying to work out how to get over that section is just killing me. So this is this is the final attempt of this level and then I'm going to have to skip it and I would have just wasted all of my lives for absolutely nothing. So this is the one. Make it count, Stampy. Make it count. Come on. Make it count. Make I didn't make it count, did I? Right, sorry everyone, on to the next one. So, my challenge was a oh, run for your life. That sounds promising. Yeah, so the challenge I set myself was to complete three levels. Halfway through the video, not completed any yet. And so, it looks like I need to, to jump up here. It's called run for your life. Oh, I've just seen. I've just seen. Okay, I see what's going on here. Have you seen the timer? See the timer at the uh, the top of the, the screen? That's that's not much time in order uh, to complete the uh, the level. So it looks like I need to be looks like I need to be very quick on this one. What's inside of this one? This looks like um, I'll be honest. This looks like a better designed level. This looks like uh, this looks like a little bit more thought has gone into it. The other one kind of seemed a little bit random and all over the place. I don't know if that's necessarily a good or a bad thing because if it was designed to be difficult, then that's not going to <laughs> uh, to help me uh, anymore. Uh, but let's just kind of uh, consider this as a, a bit of a, a practice run and uh, just trying to just trying to learn what it is that's uh, ahead of me because uh, it said run for your life. I'm assuming. It's going to be very difficult in order to, to complete it in time. And a lot of people died up there. And I don't know what they died from. You saw on the top of that little column. Right, so let's do the same thing. And let's try and be quicker. Once again, I'm kind of counting this as a, a me kind of learning the level. Like, I don't want to try and just rush through it and keep dying. If... You know, you know, just to try and do it quick, I'd rather kind of just learn the level. I can't spend too much time learning the level because I got 44 lives left and I've only completed two of the, the levels so far. So I want to get a bit of a move on, but ah, there's no point rushing through and dying. So I need to learn to wait for that. Then I can go down here and I can grab the, uh, uh, the mushroom. And then I need to try and jump out of here. I'm going to be very patient for now and uh, wait for that flame to go. And now I can jump up here. Let's avoid them just about. Let's wait for that to go. Let's jump over these guys. Goodbye. Uh, Got to go past here in case some piranha plants come out. Now, these guys are evil. These guys that throw these hammer things, these are just mean. See if I can get him. I knew I was going to get small then, but oh well. I got past him, and I got past these guys. Uh, piranha plants come out of these, so I want to push past here. Can I get rid of the wizard? There we go. That's going to help me out big time, and now I need to jump all the way down here. Let's take out you, or at least let's just hurt that one. I think that one's a boss, and aha! That's where loads of people died there. No, is this the end? Oh, okay. Oh, that was all right. Oh, that was a lovely level. Oh, that was so nice. I expected it to be so much worse, so much more difficult. Oh, that was pleasant. That was, that was really enjoyable. And look at that. I was able to complete it. A few attempts. It was challenging, but not too difficult. You, sir, are getting a star. Right, on to the next one. There it goes. That's one down. This is looking a little bit more achievable. If I have two more in a row like that, then I will be laughing. So, yeah. And let's go and head on to the uh, the next level. Look at that, level four. I don't like the way they're getting more red. I'm scared that's more uh, uh, going to be more difficult. Uh, and uh, looks like this is going to be a ghost one uh, by the looks of things. Yep, yeah, we've got a, a haunted mansion one. They're giving me a mushroom very early on, and I appreciate that. But there's a big wall here, so I'm guessing I'm going to have to he keep heading up. Let's check these. Okay, I didn't want to hit that, did I? <laughs> I better just muck things up for myself. So let's just do it again, and let's just not hit that. Uh, because yeah, I don't know. I don't know how possible it was going to be. So it looks like this might be a, a little bit more of a, a trolley one uh, by the uh, the looks of things. Uh, so let's go and uh, I want to try and get on top of this platform. So if I break one, then I can get up here. And aha! 
There we go. There's a vine so I can make my way up to the, the heavens. And oh, hello. <laughs> Let's avoid that, boo. All right. Looks like uh, I can only ride this to here. And then I'm going to have to drop down this way. Anything good there? See, I'm very scared to hit these blocks now. After what happened last time, I'm very scared. And uh, I guess that was to open the, to go through there. But you could have just ground pounded it, uh, which is something that I work, uh, learned recently. And I didn't mean to go back through there. Uh, but it's all right. I can head straight back through. And are these going to change to some coins in a second? Uh, but I don't really need to worry about that. And oh, anything good here? Oh, I've got another mushroom. They're being very generous with the, the mushrooms. And uh, <laughs> a good thing for it, seeing as there's those difficult jumps. Those are really So they wouldn't be too difficult. If it wasn't for the the booze, because you really need to, to jump and uh, worry about them at the uh, the same time. So uh, let's just not worry about that mushroom, because um, I know I'm going to get another mushroom in a second anyway. Uh, so hopefully I'm not going <laughs> to I'm not going to end up uh, regretting that. And uh, I'm going to need to use the switch this time because I can't ground pound anymore. Uh, so let's go and grab you and press that. And I can make my way through the door. So there we go. I'm back to back to where I was relatively quickly. Uh, so let's go and grab the uh, the other mushroom from up here. And then, yeah, let's try and uh, try and make my way across here. So I need to get a big jump. And oh no, these are really difficult jumps actually. These are these are right on the very limit of what I can do. I don't know, do I need to be Big Marrow? A uh, Big Marrow? Big, big, <laughs> a Big Marrow. The Big Marrow Contest 2016. Do I need to be a Big Mario in order to, to make my way through them? That's uh, that's the uh, that's the big question, but uh, that's the question that I don't have the answer for. I guess we're going to, <laughs> to find out now because it's very difficult. It's literally right on the, the very limit. Uh, of what you're you're capable of jumping up <laughs> did I really just do that I don't then I dropped it of course there was a boo sitting right underneath there this I'm being I'm not I'm being too careless I got 40 lives left I've died 60 times in the last two episodes <laughs> that's just not good is it all right let's go and make my way up here I really do think it's it's not worth bothering to uh, to get that mushroom seen as I get one uh, so soon here. All right, let's uh, let's not throw this one. Let's uh, let's keep hold of this this time and take it down here, jump on it, and go through the uh, the doorway and go and grab the uh, the mushroom which is going to be up uh, up here. Let's try and jump up like that. All right, let's try and get this uh, this jump. Then if I jump, oh no, okay, I fell straight down. But if I get this next one, no, 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 not good, not good, not good. I mean, if I'm really quick. I might, you know, like when you're kind of flashing and invincible, I might be able to make the, the most there. Like, is that, I think that jump might be possible, but I think it might literally be like the very, very limit of what you're you're able to, to jump. And uh, just with, with the pressure of the uh, the booze and things as well, uh, it's, uh, it's a little bit stressful. So uh, what I can do is I can not worry about getting the, actually, I don't even need that. Let's just go and uh, charge my way down here. Uh, yeah, so I think that if I, um, yeah, if I, if I kind of have that other, mushroom there it's kind of a bit of a backup and uh, oh do you think i'm supposed to jump and then do the uh do the spinny thing would that help me get further do you think if i do this and then spin like that ah that seemed to that seemed to help me uh, a little bit maybe maybe that's what the the trick is i'm not oh there we go look at that I went one way high. I like jumped too far. Okay, this is looking very doable. Why do I keep getting the new Mario ones? I like the old Mario ones. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't even like the um. I don't like the look of this Mario as much. Like it looks fine, but I don't know. It just doesn't have. A, for some reason, it doesn't have as much character as the old ones. And I don't know if that's nostalgia because I remember the old ones, but I don't think it is. I think it's just simply preferring like Mario, like Super Mario World is like. I don't know. I just think it looks amazing. There's just something just happy and pleasant about seeing it. And, you know, I'm not saying there's anything unpleasant about this one, but it just doesn't have that that same feeling. Anyway, I've got myself in a bit of a tricky situation here. Well, tell you what, let's just get small, because it doesn't even matter anyway, because I'm going to get another mushroom in a second. And, yeah, let's try and uh, let's try and do kind of the... Um the uh, the same strategy I did last time. So doing the uh, uh, the the spins really increased the uh, uh, yeah the 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 reach that I was able to to jump. So let's get this mushroom uh, just in case. But then let's jump and then let's spin like that. Oh no, that wasn't very good. Let's jump and spin, 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 spin. There we go. That was good. That was good. And then I want to go and jump and spin, 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 spin. There we go. All right. Let's go and take out uh, these dead bones. I think these are cool. Anything good there? There we go. There was a mushroom. I was really scared that was going to be a, another trolley block there. <laughs> All right. Let's go and try and make my way up here. Uh, there's some coins there. I'm not worrying too much about the coins. And it looks like I need to make my way down to this door. Do you reckon there's a secret thing here? Aha! There is. Look at that. I've learned them out because last time uh, there was a... Uh, the kind of the the same thing. It looks like I can't flame this guy here though. So, oh no, oh, we fell. Okay, okay, that could have been worse than it. That could have been worse than it was. And oh, oh dear, 
Why did I do that? Why haven't I not learned my lesson? Right, let's... Uh, oh, no. And this guy's coming back now. I'm going to have to drop down here. And then if I'm very careful, I can wait. Oh, no, that guy got me again. Oh, no, and this big guy's coming. <laughs> and that just went bad from us. Okay. I'm not going to hit that question block. It's just how... Because, like, sometimes the question blocks are good. And sometimes they're bad. And there's just no way of knowing. Like, that wasn't... That wasn't my fail. Like, I might have been able to get out of the situation that I got into. But, like, getting into that situation, that wasn't my fault. Like, I didn't know what was going to be in there. And, okay, that was my fault this time, though. Right, I need to be careful here. I need to try and jump and then jump my way back up here. But I've got to be very careful falling back down that I don't land on the boom. Can I even get up there? Oh, don't... See, see, this is the problem. I'm wasting lives. I've, I've just wasted There's some, which is like, okay, I failed, you know, but I learned the level a bit more. Fair enough. But these ones, that's just, just a waste. Right, let's, let's get back up there and get back into the swing of things uh, as soon as we can. I'm doing my, my normal problem of kind of mucking up on the, uh, the easy bits. I have a, a strong tendency to do that. Right, let's watch out for this boo, and let's just get out through this doorway uh, as quick as we can. And let's see if I can keep my mushroom uh, throughout all of this bit here and, uh, and not lose it, because that would be really helpful. Let's go and swing. There we go. Oh, no, nope, I got small, though. Uh, but if I just jump again, there we go. I got to, I got to here, at least, and I know that in here uh, there's uh, another mushroom as well. All right, so that's fine. I'm kind of I'm kind of back to to top uh, uh, top physical uh, condition, <laughs> and I can go and uh, try and uh, carry on. And oh no, oh no! Look, that mushroom went down, and they knocked those other boos down. Okay, well let's go and let's go and try and get this uh, this fire flower, and then I can kind of let's just try and brute force my way through because I know that big boo's coming. So if I just get hit once while I'm invisible, I should be able to get through. So I've lost the fire flower, but I'm still okay. Do I hit that question block? I think I got it. Okay, that one's safe. Like, I think I need to... Oh, no! That... Well, come on. That, that was just me. I went to jump to the platform, but then there's an invisible block. You can't blame me for these things. So, I like the challenging levels when it's... You know, you can kind of see what the challenge is. Like, so many levels, they're just challenging for the, the sake of challenging. Like, they could, you know, you could just hide things everywhere, make it almost impossible to find the way out. And, you know, without just the knowledge of the level, you know, you're just never going to do it. So that, they're, they're, that's not good. That's not a good challenge. You always want a fair challenge. You always want it to be that when you fail, like, you feel like it's your fault. You're like, oh, okay, I mucked up on this difficult level. That's kind of what you want to, to end up uh, thinking uh, when you go and, uh, and finish these levels. And this one's kind of in between. There is some kind of a good level design and there is you know some good challenge in it but then there's lots of just very difficult bits uh, as well uh, so let's uh so what set that other um what set it off the uh that uh the shell thing that went and got the booze i don't know what actually set it off and oh it's gone okay it's not even here this time Okay, well, let's make the most of this situation because now I have a, a fire flower and I was going to get another one in a second anyway, but uh, at least I can be very safe as I come through this area here. So I, let's let's go and uh, set this off uh, just because I know it's there. And then let's jump to this from the underneath. Oh, that was bad timing, wasn't it? My bad. <laughs> All right, let's just try and stay here and uh, hopefully be okay. I'm looking to the right in case there's some booze around there. I kind of want to leave them standing still. All right, I've got to jump over these saws. Oh, that was good. A minute, that was good. There's another one coming underneath. Me. I'm not out of it yet. Can I jump before it arrives? Nope, I wasn't able to. Oh, that would have been good if I avoided that last one. i got to jump over that one, though. Oh, no, no, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, so if I went into that section uh, with the, uh, the fire flower, I think it would have been okay. Did they make a rule that you're not allowed to put checkpoints in expert mode? That's what I want to know. None of these levels have had, had checkpoints in them. Like, why can't you, like, make the level difficult? I, I get it. This, these are expert levels, you know. They were made to be challenging. But give me a, just give me, come on. Give me a, just a checkpoint. Is that too much? Oh, look. Oh, I've just seen that's the end of the level right underneath me there. I only just realized that. If only there's a way I could kind of cheat my way through the floor. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. Oh, okay. That was almost really impressive until the very end there. <laughs> Admit it. You were almost impressed for a, a second then. Right, is the, is the shell guy there? I don't think he's there. Oh, no, okay, he is there. He has spawned this time. I don't know why he didn't spawn last time. But it looks like he's back now. So let's go and grab this fire flower. Oh, no, no. Oh, he's, oh it's because I went level with him. That's what made him drop. It's because I kind of got level with him. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I was able just to make my way through them all. All right, let's try and time this a little bit better. And then let's go and stand here. 
And there we go. I've kept the uh, the uh, the fire flower on me there, and I did a good job of avoiding them. And now I'm back to the uh, the saws. And oh no! I just dropped off. I just dropped off the edge. Oh, that was going so well. Oh, come on! I can do this. I can do this. I'm not getting mad. I'm not getting angry. I'm not getting angry. I'm getting determined. There's a difference between anger and determination. I got a severe sense of determination now. Like that. That's what I feel. When I fail, I'm just like, right. I'm gonna do. It. I'm gonna complete this stupid level, and I'm gonna prove that I can do it. And I have 30. 23 lives left to do it. I've almost given up <laughs> the uh, the possibility of actually completing uh, the 100 Mario challenge this go, but I am not giving up on this level yet. It seems like an okay challenge. It, feel, it, see, it seems like a, an achievable but very difficult challenge. Uh, so let's try and do that section. Oh, look at that. There we go. Then I impressed you. you got to admit me then. That time I did impress you, didn't I? Right, I don't even need to worry about getting that mushroom as I already have one. Right, so when I get level... With that guy, he's going to drop. But if he's facing the other way, there we go, see? See, there's all of these things about Mario that I just still don't know about. So if I go, oh no, oh hello. Okay, I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go, I might be able to get through. Oh, look at that. I was able to, to get through and keep the fire flower. Let's get straight onto to this, shall we? Oh, okay, that's bad. That, that is really bad actually, because having that, uh, being able to take that extra hit would have been very useful. So now don't drop off the edge. <laughs> I need to jump like this. And then the problem is I bang my head there. There we go. With my little spin, I was able to, to do that okay. And now let's just jump and get over to, to this one here very quickly. And then this one's even harder. Oh no, 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 no. I jumped too far. Oh, that was almost good. If I started from like the far left of that platform and jumped and do, did the, the spin, I think I'd have been okay. And if I kept that fire flower as well, I think that there's a very good chance of being uh, able to, yeah, to being able to have done that. Okay, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm learning the level. I'm learning the little ins and outs. Remember the first time I did this level? And uh, look at me now. Like, this bit isn't a problem whatsoever. Even that jump over this bit here, which was the hardest thing in the world for me a little bit ago. Uh, you know, it's not that hard now. And I feel like I feel like I'm feel like i learning my Mario skills. Like, I never did those, like, little spin jumps uh, before this. You know, but now, you know, now I need to, to do them in order to, to be able to, to succeed. Uh, it doesn't matter that I got small then, because there's another mushroom here. I've learned how these guys work now, uh, which is very uh, handy. So I don't want to jump up there. There yet because he's looking. I want to try and keep the. Oh, okay, okay. Maybe I don't have to be the same level of him. Uh, maybe I just I just need to be like the same side as him. So I don't care about getting hit there uh, because I know there's another fire flower uh, right here. So I can go and grab this one here instead and then just jump down here like this. And let's really try and avoid this fire now and try. Oh no, 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 no. Ah, you can't tell where they're gonna jump from. To be fair, I mean I could have had a chance of learning it, uh, but apart from just learning it, I'd have no way of knowing. And oh no, I missed that one as well. And that was supposed to be the easier one as well. All right, I can jump to this one, uh, fine like that. And then actually maybe being small might actually make that easier. And apparently it didn't. <laughs> so I thought maybe if I'm small, then like I can jump and like I can kind of fit in that smaller gap. And uh, sorry, this is a really long episode, by the way. I don't really want to cut it. So sometimes like when it goes to a long episode like this, I kind of want to cut it. But I feel like I feel like I'm getting so much better each go. I want to I want to take you on my journey. I want to take you on my uh, journey of discovery and self-improvement, okay? So we're all we're all going through this together and hopefully hopefully you're learning something as well by watching this. Maybe not Mario skills, but maybe you're <laughs> learning something about yourself, maybe? Maybe about your endurance to, to sit through me struggling through these levels. <laughs> I mean, this is what it's for, isn't it? This is what the expert 100 Mario challenge is for. It's for situations just like this. Uh, so once again, I don't even care about those boos. I might have actually, if I'm really quick, be able to make my way through. Oh, no, I should have jumped then. I might have been able to, to make that. But to be honest, I think going and getting this fire flower anyway is probably the uh, the easiest way to, to do this. All right, so let's go and jump now. And so where? Okay, that's good. Oh, this is good. I avoided them. If I stay in the middle of these two, that was very good there. And then I got to here. Okay, this is a very good start. I haven't had the... Uh I was going to say I haven't had the fire flower here for a while, and then I just immediately die. But there we go. This is still okay. At least I'm not small. At least I'm still big. So I can take one more hit right now. I just really don't want to, to fall off this. There we go. Let's go. Oh, that was so close. Oh, no, there's another one. They're doing it again. No, I think what I could do, if I, if I get hit by the first one, if I like run like forward really fast, I might be able to get past the uh, the next one while I'm still invincible. You know, like after you get hit, you're invincible for just like a, a second. I think that I might be able to kind of just charge through that that next one while you know while I'm still flashing. But if I had the fire flower, like I think I could have got past that section fine at all. I nearly jumped straight onto to that boo there. <laughs> right, let's uh, let's just try and do this bit. Like I'm kind of just trying to to speed run these first sections now. I'm just trying to like now I've done them so many times. I'm just trying to do them as quick as I can. Actually, I need to be careful. 
careful here, because, oh, because otherwise that's going to happen. See, that was a wasted one. That, that is why I shouldn't try and speed run the beginning. <laughs> yeah, let's have another go. Why not? Let's see. Let's pretend for the beginning section that I'm on a speed run, because I think I am kind of doing it the fastest way. Ignore that mushroom. Uh, head up here. Jump up here as soon as I can. And then I want to remember, I want to jump down to the uh, the right here, uh, because otherwise there's the, the boo there. Let's drop you and bounce through here. Get through the door. There we go. I did that part pretty quick. This is kind of the, the first real challenge of the, the level, I guess. Uh, this way here. No, don't go. No, I lost the mushroom. Right, this is still okay. Because I can still... Okay, it's not okay. It's not okay. I needed that mushroom. <laughs> I just, even if not to help me, I just need it for confidence. 28. 28 Mario's left. There were 100. At the beginning of the last episode, there were a hundred of these little Marios, and I'm down to 28. <laughs> oh, this is going awfully. It's I will. Okay, I'm going to make a statement now, and I'm going to stick to this statement. Otherwise, you can tell me off for the rest of my life, okay? I am going to complete the 100 Mario challenge. Probably not on this attempt. I mean, well, definitely not in this uh, this attempt here, but at some point... I am going to face my demons and I'm going to go and I'm going to be able to complete this 100 Mario challenge. Because if I just keep doing it, like eventually I'm going to get good enough, aren't I? Like eventually I'm going to be able to, to pick up the uh, the skills I need in order to be able to complete this thing. Like surely, surely it's just given enough time and enough attempts, like I'm going to get, I'm going to become a Mario master. I mean, that's really like being good at anything. That's really like all it's uh, it's about. It's just doing it enough times, you know, to, to learn exactly how to do it. Like, you know, like there's specifically, oh, why did, I saw, I think, I think what it is, is because I did that other section too quickly. Like the saws weren't lined up the way, the way I want them to be, if that makes sense. Right, let's try and do this. Oh, look, look at that. Okay, jump and spin. Okay, okay, I didn't get past the second one, but I got past the first one. This is the, this is the best I've ever done now. So I'm trying to be very careful. And it looks like I need to go down this pipe. Uh, yeah, okay, I can go down the, the pipe here. This is bringing me back to this world. Please don't be booze. Okay, it's a mushroom, but can I get it? Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Okay, and now I need to go again. Okay, that's small, but it's okay. I got past it. There's a, there's another, there's another question block there. I, th I think they are going to fire booze though. Uh, right, let's try and uh, jump on this Goomba. I don't want to set that shell guy off because I think it's going to spawn some booze down. But I need to go and try and get up here. Let's, do you reckon I can get another Goomba to, to fall down? So I think I might be able to, to jump on the, uh, the Goomba uh, in order to, to get up to the, uh, the top. You know, the, the Goombas with the, the wings? Or can I just get up to the top anyway by doing that technique? I don't, I don't think I can. Oh, steady on now. Steady on now. I don't want that, that guy to start going after me. That's what I'm worried about because I, I reckon there's booze inside of them. And I don't want to, I don't want to, to release them for, for obvious reasons. <laughs> I, what I want to do is I want to keep kind of jumping up near that pipe. And then hopefully there's a, another Goomba's going to come out of it. Come on, Goomba. Come on, please spawn, Goomba. Come out the pipe. Oh, no, they're not spawning. How am I going to get out of here then? I think I might have to go and jump on, on that shell in order to, to jump out. So I don't know what else I could do. Okay. So... I've got, I've got rid of the shell for now. I'm really scared it's going to set some, some booze out. Um, picking it up probably was a bad idea. Can I drop it carefully? Oh, no. Oh, there's a vine. There's a vine. It actually helped me. Oh, no. Oh, steady on. Okay. Jump up to here. Jump down to here. Jump up to here. And then, no, no. No. That was going so well. I can do this. 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 Right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I can do this. I was doing so well then, and I didn't know what I was doing either. And then, ah, oh, just one step away, one step away. Right, let's go, let's go. I'm just, I'm more enthusiastic than ever. Like, a lot of people, when they fail again and again and again, it just puts them off wanting to do it. And, you know, I guess there has been a little bit of that in some of the past levels where I've skipped. But for this one, it's just making me want to complete it more and more. The feeling I get when I complete this level, if I complete this level, is going to be absolutely amazing. Let's go and do this. Oh, look at that. Genius. A Mario genius I am. And oh, <laughs> maybe not. Okay. Back to, back to normal, I guess. Right. Let's go get this mushroom just to, uh, just to stay safe for this section. Uh, let's go and uh, head down this way. I always like to get this fire flower. It's just a bit of insurance. You know, it just means I can take one more hit, uh, which should help me out. So yeah, like it doesn't really matter about getting hit here. Even if I get made small, it doesn't matter. Because I know I'm going to get another one here. Uh, right then. So this is where this is where things start to get really tricky. So I don't I don't think I want to be too quick here. 
because otherwise otherwise it's kind of not in line i want to be able to to kind of jump around like that there we go so i think last time when i was too fast like the the saw and the uh, the platform uh, were kind of out of line a little bit and that's what made it really difficult for me so i took a hit then when i really didn't want to and oh no i took a hit there okay i gotta do this one perfectly oh no <laughs> i thought i might be able to do that then i really cut to so that first one that easier one where there's the uh, the higher ceiling I really can't afford to, to take a hit on that level there. Like that's just not an option. Because then if I'm like if I'm made small at that point, those second two ones are so difficult. The chances of me uh, completing them uh, are just uh, are just pretty slim. All right, let's uh, let's get back to there uh, as quick as we can, and uh, let's go and uh, and try and have uh, another attempt. Then shall we? Let's go and grab the mushroom. Let's see if we can not get hit here. That was good. That was good. That was very good. There we go. That was that was pretty smooth. I feel like I'm getting a little bit of a, a rhythm for for that section. I don't need to worry about this mushroom. Let's go down and get the uh, the fire flower just to just to be safe and right, let's go and grab this this guy's gonna go crazy i don't even care because i'm gonna get another fire flower in just one second and uh, let's try and uh, let's try and get the timing right on this one uh, so i don't get hit on that first saw so i think i just i think i just need to be quite slow like because basically things start moving once you are uh, basically like once you uh once you see them essentially so if i kind of wait at the last minute see now that saw started moving slightly later you see how much easier that was uh, than kind of some of the the past attempts and there we go and i still have the fire flower okay this is this is looking like a, a very good attempt i'm not going to jinx it of course but not a not a bad start. So if I can get hit here and on the the next one. I'm also going to try not to, but this is still okay. This still this still isn't too bad. Cause now I can go and jump up here, and uh, now I can go and get through the pipe. Oh no 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 no! Oh wait a minute. Do you reckon there's a way to kind of skip it and get to that next pipe? I don't know if there is. I don't. I don't know if that job is possible. Oh, that was looking good though. Okay. I've, ev with every attempt, I learn. I learn a few more skills and kind of get a little bit better at the map. So that was a bit of a fail. But I'm going to just take it as part of the learning process. And I'm going to go back in with a big grin on my face. Well, a big grimace on my face. And do it again. And oh, really? Have I just done this to myself? I've trapped myself. I can't get out. There's literally no... I can't grab that thing. This... This has to be the worst attempt at a Mario level anyone's ever done. Right, can I... Let's just uh, let's just start over, shall we? <laughs> I, I dropped it on my head and I trapped myself down. That's a new one. See, I'm finding new and inventive ways to fail. That's one of the, the proud achievements I have. <laughs> right, let's do this. I'm actually starting to now get uh, to get really worried, like let alone completing the uh, the 100 levels. Or well, the, not the 100 levels, however many levels there are. Like not only am I worried about uh, completing them, I'm worried about running out of attempts for this level. That's where, that's where things are gonna get um, uh, really worrying. So right, let's go grab the mushroom. Let's do that. Oh no! Okay, I, lo I lost my rhythm. I forgot about I forgot about the rhythm. I built up a rhythm for that section, and uh, and uh, I didn't stick to it. That's worrying. That's worrying about my my mental state going into to this round here. I need to be I need to be calm. I, I think I think I I think when I start getting to like a new area or kind of getting close to like as far as I've been, I start I start to get panic, and I don't think it helps me. I don't think it helps my gameplay. So I think remaining calm. As much as I can is going to be. I think that's going to be the the way to go about this. So let's. Oh no, that isn't good. It will. Oh, okay, well, careful now. I don't want to get hit by that fire. All right, I want to once again wait. Oh no. To be. I think. I think I was just in the wrong state of mind. I think from that that entire attempt, I just. I don't think I was in a good place. I need to. I need to get in harmony. I need to. I need to do the technique. You know where you just think of your happy place. I need to think of um. I need to think of a, a field. I'm lying in a field, a wheat field. Actually, no, I'm not. I've got hay fever. Um, where, where's my happy place? I'm in my bedroom. I'm in bed. I'm asleep. I'm dreaming. I'm relaxed. I'm calm. I'm playing a video game. I'm not playing Mario Maker. I'm playing a happy game where, where it's very easy and it's and you never fail. That's my that's my happy place. I get. I think maybe, I think when you think about not failing. That's kind of the the thing that makes you fail. So if I kind of if I kind of just if I kind of take away all of the stress and the worry about not being able to to achieve what I'm trying to achieve, I think that might make a I think that might make me perform better. So let's uh let's just not worry about let's not worry about failing. Let's just assume failing isn't an option. All I'm doing is I'm just, you know, going about my business, doing what needs to be done, you know, working to, to achieve what, what I need to achieve and hopefully going to be able to successfully do it. All right, I want to be careful because one's about to come up right here. There we go. That was good. And I want to jump to, oh, I think I jumped a little bit too early here, making that bit more difficult, but I still did it. Despite it being more difficult, I still did it. And there we go. I did that bit as well. Okay, this is this is good. 
I'm not I'm not gonna get too happy. I'm just still in my still in my happy place, still just relaxing, still doing still doing what needs to be done. Dum de dum de dum, yep, very easy. Okay, no worries, I got hit. That's fine. I don't even worried. If you could see my face right now, you'd see that I don't have a worried face. Gonna jump down here and land on this pipe. Easy peasy. Go down the pipe. No problem whatsoever. Going about my daily business. Dum de dum de dum de dum. Right, let's um Let's go and uh, uh, avoid some of these fireballs, which will be no problem whatsoever. I'm gonna land on here. I'm gonna jump on here. I got small, that's fine. I fell down a bit, it's okay. I can just go and jump up a little bit here. There's a Goomba, that's fine. I don't mind Goombas. Goombas are absolutely delightful. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna jump on this guy, give him a little bit of a tap. He's gonna hit this. I'm gonna jump on the vine and I'm gonna climb up the vine. Easy peasy, one, two, three. I'm gonna keep going up here because I found another chest. I'm gonna hit it and I'm gonna get a fire flower. This is gonna help me a lot. I'm gonna go on the vine, I'm gonna gently go and climb back down and land back on the platform. Absolutely fine, no worries about it whatsoever. I'm gonna jump and land on here again. I'm gonna jump and land on here again. I'm gonna jump and I'm gonna make it to a place I've never been before. But I'm not stressed. I'm not worried about failing. I'm absolutely fine right now. I'm relaxed. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> it worked though! You gotta admit it, that, that technique of staying calm, that really worked. This is, um... This is a bit tricky here though. I guess I need to, to jump and bounce off the wall, but I kind of hit my head on that side. I'm kind of scared to jump this way in case I kind of just jump off the level. Oh, there we go. All right, that seems to be the way I got to do it though. And there we go. I'm up the pipe. I'm in a new area. I'm going to try. I'm not going to speak like a crazy person, but I'm still going to try and remain calm. So I want to jump while that platform's going down so I can easily get onto it. And now I can go and land here. I don't want to hit any of them. Because I've already got the fire flower, so unless there's like a star or something, there's not really anything I need there. Actually, no, I think there is. I think I need a P switch. And there we go, right on cue. Here is my P switch. Right, let's. Oh no, okay, that was bad. Let's. Oh no, oh no, I dropped the P switch off. Oh no, now I'm getting small. Is there another one? Nope, that's just a load of ghosts. Okay, I'm in trouble now. Is this. I'm gonna stay calm, but I think I might have just ruined it for myself. Uh, right. Uh, yeah, I think, I think, I don't think there's anything I can do. I, th I think it's kind of game over at this point. Let's, uh, <laughs> let's just go and take a running leap and see if we can at least see. Oh, okay, I've got to get to that door. Wow. Okay. I can see. I'm not even upset. I know I got really close and, like, I, I, I had everything in my favor there, but... You know, I got further than I've been before, and I think my staying calm technique, as, uh, as as obvious as it sounds, it really helped me. I just, I looked at one task at a time, I made it very matter of fact, and I was able to, to complete it. It was only kind of when I got to a new area, and I got a little bit confused and things, you know, did uh, did I get taken out. So, uh, yeah, I think I think if I get back to that area next time, I think I should definitely at least be able to, to get through that door. Obviously, I don't know what challenges are, are coming up afterwards, uh, so I have no idea whether I'm going to complete the, uh, the level or not. Uh, but yeah, let's uh, let's go and give it another go then. Let's go and grab the the mushroom. Like it's kind of like paint by numbers for this section here. Like <laughs> I know exactly what needs to be done here. And no, I tried I tried to be clever and slide under him there. But once again. It doesn't really matter, so I'm gonna go and get another fire flower here. The one thing I will say about this level is it has been uh, very, uh, very generous uh, over all of these, these like the fire flowers and the uh, the, the mushrooms. Uh, sometimes these maps aren't very friendly uh, with that, uh, so this this map has been. This map's really been uh, very nice and in, in, in giving me all of the. Um, and lots of power-ups and things, so there's no checkpoint. I would have loved a checkpoint, kind of maybe just about where I died in the last level. Uh, a checkpoint there would have been really nice. It didn't give me one, but it, but it's okay. And oh, I didn't even jump there. Okay, it's all right though. I got past like kind of, kind of. This is that's kind of like the trickiest bit, isn't it? Really, because I can now go and uh, make my way down into this pipe here. That's quite a tricky jump there, because jumping from those conveyor belts uh, can be very difficult. So, what I can't remember what was in these. Okay, there's a mushroom there. Then what was in the? I, I think it was something bad in the other one, wasn't it? Um, I'm pretty sure it was. So let's go and oh no, no, that was bad timing. Okay, I really want to. I really want to make sure I can grab that mushroom. Uh, I thought, oh no luck, because the first time I did it, I jumped and I grabbed the mushroom mid-air. That's what I did, because it's really hard to get that mushroom, because it kind of just basically goes and just heads straight off the, uh, the edge of, uh, the, uh, the level. Thanks for watching, by the way. Thanks for- oh no, that was rubbish. Thanks for sticking with me, what's this? We're going, like, over 40 minutes? Over 40 minutes of almost the same Mario level? <laughs> like, I can't end it now. Like, I don't want to edit, I just want to see- Well, so what I can do, so on YouTube, you have, uh, you have YouTube analytics, which is basically just like the stats of the video, and then you can see uh, retention time, which is basically how much of the uh, the video, you know, has someone watched. And I can't wait to see what it is for this video. I want to see, you know, how many people clicked on the video anyway, 
when they saw how long the video was and how many have stuck to this point. <laughs> it's going to be really interesting to see. Like, I know, obviously, if you're listening to this, then you have. But it'll be interesting to see, like, you know, on average, what percentage of the uh, the video uh, did most people watch? Because uh, I, I think it's got to be under 50%. I don't know. Like, I, I think it's like I'm, I'm having fun. Like, I'm having a blast. Like, if I if I wasn't having fun, like, I would have ended the, uh, the video ages ago. So I'm still, you know, I'm still really enjoying it. Uh, you know, but it's kind of, it is a bit of an endurance uh, game uh, a bit, I guess, a little bit. And oh, no. Okay, that was a little bit dangerous. Oh, no. That is always a big worry. When I get hit by that fire, that always, that always sends off alarm bells in my head. So it's still doable. It means I have to, though, not get hit by one of the saws on the next section and I've done it I've, I've done it plenty of times but it means I have to means I have to get this section perfect and oh no so it's got to be this one I've got to be able to get this one perfect I oh, know I did it I actually did it okay this is good this is good this is good this is good okay staying calm staying staying very very calm jump from the conveyor belt if I can that was always a tricky one and I made my way down here right let's see if I can let's see if I can get this uh this mushroom then so if I jump and grab it there we go so that's what I did the the first time as well so I got made small uh, but at least I made it past that section there. I can get rid of the uh, the Goomba. I don't need to worry about him. And then let's go and uh, let's set this guy off like this. And I can go and grab on the, the vine. And uh, oh no. Oh wait a minute. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, I did that wrong. I should have kept going up. Shouldn't I? Because there's a fire flower up at the top. But then I jumped. Oh, that was that was all me. Uh, hands up. Of course, it was, I'm the one controlling, of course. <laughs> I'm not going to blame you, am I? I guess I could blame Mario. I, I do sometimes blame Mario. I'm actually... I'm actually starting to get a little bit worried about my controller. Uh, oh no, because the um yeah the the Wii U controller, if you don't have one, it doesn't it doesn't last very long because it's got a big screen in it, like doesn't it? It's got it's basically like a big tablet with buttons, and so because it's got a big screen on it, the battery doesn't last as long as most controllers. And I've been doing this for a while now, and it was fully charged before I've started, but this is going to be a an active use test, I guess, of the uh, the Wii U uh, controller. Also endurance. So what have we got? 18 lives. So I got at most there's going to be 18 attempts left, which is a uh, which is still quite a lot. Uh, but yeah, it means that. You know, this isn't going to go on forever. And oh no, I can't be doing that. I can't be throwing away attempts on these easy sections. I need to, I feel like I want to make the most of each life. I want to either get better at something or I want to find, you know, a new area and get further. Because I feel like if I can get past that saw section, if I, if I feel like in the last time, if I'd gone and got that fire flower like I should have, I felt, I felt like I had a good chance uh, to get at least as far as I did, you know, the time when I got really far, uh, if not much further. Because I kind of I kinda mucked up. I kind of mucked up, but I did. So that time when um I got really far, what I did is... Oh, that was cool. I did, like, the uh, the triple jump, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, that time when I did get really far, I learned that all of the chests, apart from the far right one, has booze in. So I had no way of knowing that at first, but, like, I've learned that now. So uh, if I kind of remember that uh, for, for future attempts, I should be okay. So it's very crucial here that I don't get hit. Uh, by any of the other uh, fire. Uh, uh, I think if I kind of stay in the middle here, there we go. I'm kind of, I'm, ge I'm getting better at that. And uh, hopefully that was good timing for this saw. If I jump and spin, ooh, that was very close. I'm getting much better at that one. I'm getting much better at doing that one. I think I've learned now that, because before I was trying to do multiple spins, I've kind of learned more now that you can really only have time for one spin. So I'm really just trying to time it better. So this is okay. Like, I've lost the Fire Flower, uh, but I'm not small, Mario. And uh, I should, uh, it should give me a little bit of a of a insurance uh, just for some of these uh, these next sections here. So what this means is I don't need to, to worry about going uh, for that mushroom there. So let's go and, oh no, okay, that was bad. Oh no, okay, it's okay, it's okay. Look, look at this. Okay, it's all right, it's all right. That could have been disastrous. Oh, hello, Goomba. If I got killed by a Goomba, then I would have cried. <laughs> all right, let's be very careful with this guy. Let's go and grab it. And I'm going to bounce it that way first, just to be very safe. And then I can go and uh, make my uh, way up here. And I'm going to get the fire flower. I remembered everyone. <laughs> so yeah, this is this is good. So all of those hits that I took earlier, they don't mean anything anymore. Because I'm back here. I have the fire flower, which is kind of as good as things could, could be. So now I can jump up onto... Oh no, okay. I got hit. That's okay. It's still okay. It's still okay. It's not... Oh no, it's, it's still okay. It's still okay. Okay. So I marked that section up. I hold my hands up. I didn't do that section as well as, uh, as I could have. And uh, what? I was on top of it. I fell at it from above. Oh no! Okay, I can I can do that section so much better. The problem is, like, it's not difficult. I just haven't done it very much. Like these early sections, you know, that these are some of these sections are harder than that section. But I've just done them so many times. I've just mastered them at this point. Well, I'm not mastered. At least I've got I've got decent at them. Let's 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 just say uh, let's just say that. Let's not go as far as to say mastered. But yeah, I've done these sections so many times. 
you know, I'm just trying to get the hang of them, basically. But that section there, I'm always, I'm always just a bit nervous, just because at that point I've got that far, and oh no, that was rubbish. Uh, yeah, but also just, you know, I just, I kind of just haven't learned the pattern of everything, where the enemies are coming from, you know, where all the traps are and things. Uh, so yeah, I'm always kind of, kind of just going off instincts a little bit, and sometimes I can, uh, but sometimes I just get a bit confused and then things go all wrong. Right then, let's, let's just make sure I have a, a successful attempt uh, for this bit here then. So I want to go and grab the uh, the P button, uh, go and drop it down here, and uh, and go through the uh, the door here. I can't afford to throw away any more lives now. Fifteen. 15 lives remaining, that's all I have. So I've got to be really careful. Oh no, I did that jump again. That's just that's just satisfying. That's just really cool to see. So I got made small there. It doesn't matter. It didn't matter too much because I got this mushroom here. And I want to be careful here. I don't want to get made small again. I mean, there is a, another fire flower here. Like this bit's actually, like it's challenging. But they give you so many mushrooms and fire flowers. It just doesn't really matter. You don't have to really worry about avoiding the uh, the enemies and uh, let's uh, let's try and avoid oh no that was just bad I see I just tried to go too quick I was just trying to, to rush too much and it ended up not working and I have made bit past this section before though uh, without having the uh, the fire flower it's just very much easier so all I need to do is get past one just one of those saws on this side here I need to be able to to get past and there we go that was it so even if I get hit, hit here, uh, then it doesn't matter too much. So uh, I did get hit, uh, but it's okay. I should be fine to carry on. It means, though, to get that next mushroom, uh, which I really want, I kind of have to do that difficult jump, though. But I've done it twice before, and it's always worked out. So I can kind of jump and then grab that. Then if I spin, I can kind of avoid the piranha. Oh, there's that one that gets me, though. That's a very difficult timing. And oh, no, the Goomba! The falling Goomba! I can't believe it! Ah! There's just so many things that I need to remember. I can't believe I, can't believe I did that really difficult section. <laughs> and then I got killed by a Goomba that fell from the uh, the heavens. <laughs> I'm really getting into this map, though. I mean, you think I would, considering how long uh, I've played it. But I'm really, <laughs> I'm really getting into the swing of things. I'm really, oh, maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm not. Maybe I'm just doing as bad as ever. Right, how many? Was this like 13? So unlucky 13 lives. Left. It'd be cool if I completed it on this attempt with 13 lives left. Because, you know, like, 13 is, like, the unlucky number, apparently, even though I'm born on the 13th. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah, it'd be cool to, to kind of complete it on the uh, the unlucky number just to go, ha, how unlucky is the number now? So that there we go. Here's my challenge. Well, I mean, my challenge is just to complete the level anyway, but it's just an extra challenge to complete it on here. Let's see if I can do that big bouncy thing. Oh, no. That wasn't good, right? I don't want to waste. I don't want to waste this attempt. Uh, there we go. So it uh, looks like a uh, looks like I haven't I haven't wasted the uh, the attempt at least. I just need to be very careful for now until I grab the mushroom. And right, business uh, business as usual. That uh, little hiccup. Uh, I can kind of ignore the fact that it happened. Go and grab this. Go and oh, I always try and slide under it, but then it drops down, doesn't it? So it doesn't actually <laughs> it doesn't actually work like that. Uh, right then, let's go and grab the uh, the fire flower. And I I just hate dying on this bit. I just hate dying on this section here. So I just feel like it should be, um, I feel like it should be so avoidable. So I want to stay here, and then there's that next fire, and then I jump down there like that. This bit, I haven't had trouble with this bit for a while. Like, these two here, I haven't, I don't want to jinx it, but yeah, they, they haven't hit me in a while. I didn't even need to do the, uh, the spin, uh, that time. So this is, this is a, this is a nice start. This is a pleasant start. And, uh, for the unlucky 13th, <laughs> it's especially good. So, it'd be lovely to not get hit there. Ah, oh, I did. So yeah, because if I didn't get hit there, I wouldn't have, uh, needed to, to have worried about getting that next mushroom. And that is kind of the, uh, the thing that is, uh, is really difficult. Uh, but it looks like, it looks like I'm going to get it again. So if I do this section kind of as fast as I can, I need to see send it out and then jump then I need to go so let's wait here for a second and then oh no okay that's bad okay I'm just trying to get the timing right so I can um stay big for there I was able I remembered about the Goomba that time so don't don't worry about that <laughs> and uh, now oh no oh no but it got me anyway oh that's just embarrassing ah oh, that's just that's just an embarrassing fail I can't be doing it I guess that's why it's the 13th level, but I can't be doing failures like that anymore. I'm supposed to be above that. I'm supposed to be beyond that uh, now. Like, I'm supposed to be I'm supposed to be an improved Mario at this point. I shouldn't be failing on those easy things like that. I'm getting super quick at this beginning section. Though. Look at that. Blink and you would have missed that then. <laughs> right, let's see if I can do this. But I, I always like doing this bit perfect. It really doesn't matter if I fail it anyway. Oh, here we go. I'm going to do the triple bounce. Oh, that's good. It didn't help me, but it still looked cool. <laughs> right, let's go and uh, get past these guys and go and grab Grab this mushroom. I always feel a little bit safer once I've got that. Uh, let's go and get the uh, the mushroom, not the mushroom, the uh, the fire flower from here. Let's try and jump. Ah, uh, I don't know if I can physically jump over it. I don't know if I if I like jumped and crouched then. If I'd have been able to, to fit through. And right, let's try and get the uh, the timing right on this section here. I want to go as far back as I can. There we go. 
Okay, so I've kept either fire flower for here. This generally means that I'm gonna- Oh no! I've lost it immediately! Okay, I shouldn't have lost it on that one there. So this is still doable, but it means that I'm gonna have to do at least one of the, uh, the really tricky sections. So let's try and get this- let's try and get this timing good, and- Oh no! Okay, it's gotta be this one. It's gotta be this one or I fail. There we go! I did it. It is easier when you're small, so that's why I seem to be making that last one. It means that I gotta go after that difficult mushroom on this next section here. I've done it a few times though, so it's not undoable. And I might just, uh, I might not worry about getting hit by this guy. Actually, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, no, he got me. Right, the, the Goomba. The Goomba's coming. I'm remembering it. If I go and grab this guy, go on. where's the Goomba? Where is he? Oh, he didn't come. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I think because I didn't jump high enough, the uh, the Goomba didn't jump out. Uh, so let's get out of here, and then I can get the Fire Flower, then all of my all of my failings don't really matter at that point, because uh, I'm strong again. So this is the part where I got, I just got confused at this part last time. So I want to, I want to kind of take my, uh, take my time a little bit more, and uh, try and master it. So I want to jump and land up there. Okay, I got hit once, but that's okay. Okay, I got hit once again, but let's just make it across. Okay, so I made it across to here. I, once again, I've never mastered that section, uh, just because I've never practiced it. I don't want to get hit by that guy. Oh, I kind of just pushed him down. I don't think I was uh, heavy enough to kill him. <laughs> so I kind of just pushed him down a little bit. All right, I made my way to, to here. Uh, I need to jump up to there, and then I want to jump to the the next one while it's going down. And then let's look at that boo there, just to just to say back off, back off, boo. <laughs> All right, let's wait until I'm kind of at the uh, the the peak that I go to here, and then let's jump to the next one. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. I got to get this P switch here, and let's drop it, and then hit that, and then here we go. No, where did they come from? Where did they come from? No, I was so sure I was gonna make it out of nowhere. Oh, if I had just one mushroom, I'd have made that then. Okay, like, I mean, I died. I mean, that wasn't my- I didn't know they were there. I think that was, you know, the, the shell that's, um, oh, brilliant. And I failed at this bit as well. Can I, can I make it up? Can I save this attempt? No, okay, I can't. So yeah, I think, you know, the, the shell that, you know, I kind of run past every time. I think that is above me during that section. And I think that's what set those boos out. And oh, okay, now I'm just getting silly. Okay, this is, this is getting serious at this point, guys, now. Okay, I have nine lives left. Okay, it looks like this video is going to be going over an hour long. <laughs> I have nine, every attempt matters big time now. I'm more determined than ever. Like nine lives is nothing. I can remember, consider, I started off with a hundred doing this challenge. <laughs> and I, I can't remember how many I had when I started this level, but it was a lot. And I've gone through almost all of them. This is, this is more serious than it's ever been. I can't, I can't die here. I can't die here. I can't, there we go. If I died then, that would have been disastrous. Every failure is awful. Now, yeah, it is, look. See, look under the ground. That section there, that's the section that I got, I just got to uh, just now, isn't it? And that's kind of just that same bit again. Right, let's go here. I'm going to get hit by this guy. It doesn't really matter. Uh, let's go. Oh, okay. I've got a shell with me this time. Hello. Okay, let's get rid of that. <laughs> right, let's go and uh, get up to here. And so I think if when I jump down, when they're kind of at the peak of their jump, uh, that seems to be the, the best time to go. And oh, no, it's not. No, I should have gone further forward. Okay, I'm just like, I've not made it impossible. I've just made this bit much more difficult on myself so i can do that oh no okay i gotta do every section perfectly i gotta do two perfect jumps on the most difficult ones otherwise this is going to be another disastrous failed attempt right let's jump and spin there we go okay that's one that's one down jump and spin oh i did it against all odds i was able to make it okay that's good that was good that's that's filled me with a little bit more confidence let's make sure i don't mess up this jump i gotta be careful with every section if i go and get this mushroom again now it might all it might all kind of pay off so I want to jump and oh no, okay, I missed the mushroom. Can I make it? Ah, oh, no. I wonder, I wonder if I like land on the edge of that pipe, if I can avoid it. Because it kind of comes right out the middle. It kind of almost looked like there that I was going to be able to um to land on the pipe, but only on the very edge and still be able to, to make it. Uh, that would be cool. That might be, that might be worth having a little bit of an attempt to do. It's just hard to start trying something new when you only got have, uh, have eight lives left. The thing is like, I haven't even seen the end of the level. I don't even know how close to the end of the level I am. It looks like, just by looking at the uh, the underneath of this section, it looks like I'm getting close. It, it looks like it might be just after that section there, uh, but I don't know for sure where that door's going to lead. So yeah, I haven't, that's the scary thing. Like I feel like I'm getting better and I feel like I'm getting close to mastering the sections that, that I've done. 
but I still haven't seen it all yet. So there's still, there's still, I guess, like, unknown challenges coming up. But that was pretty good, wasn't it? Right, let's just try and jump straight up here. And I want to go far, far to the front. And now I want to, oh, do okay, there we go. That was good. That was very good there. I was able to avoid all of them. I want to jump to this platform quite last minute to make that section easier. There we go. I didn't mess up on the, uh, the easy ones or that one there. So this is good. I still have the, uh, the fire flower. It would be lovely. Oh, no! No, I'm missing the easy bits again. Why do, why do I do one bit perfect and then mess up on like the easy one after it? Seven attempts left. Come on, here we go. Lucky number seven. It didn't work for unlucky number 13, but will it work for lucky number 13? <laughs> Who's still watching it at this point? Don't you have anything to do today? Is this a lazy day for you to sit here and watch me play Mario Maker for an hour? It must be. <laughs> it's a lazy day for me playing it. <laughs> right then, if you're, if you're watching... The video at this point, okay, comment the word hamster, okay? And then, then I'll know that you really did watch the entire video. So yeah, just comment the word hamster, and then I'll know that you are a true fan, and didn't just leave a comment, uh, but did actually go and watch through the uh, the entire video. So yeah, I want to see as many hamsters in the, uh, the comments, and don't explain to anyone else why you're leaving the comment hamster because uh, then we can just kind of confuse everyone that clicked off the uh, the video in the first five like attempts <laughs> right i want to be really careful here because that's coming back up there we go that was good there let's avoid these oh okay that was a little bit tricky but i was able to oh no did i miss that why am i missing the easy bits now the problem is i'm thinking too far ahead i'm already planning ahead to like the you know the the bits that you know that I need to get to later on and I'm kind of I'm kind of looking past these sections it's like when people talk about going to tournaments they say never look past like the other opponents like never think oh this person's going to be easy I'm just going to get past them to get to the um the more challenging people you never want to do that because those are the uh, those are the times you fail so I want to I kind of want to to kind of have every section of the uh, the map to, to feel like it has uh, just uh, as much uh, importance as the, the other sections. All right then, let's go and get uh, up to the, the top here if I can. I want to be really careful for this bit. There we go. That was uh, uh, easily uh, enough done. And uh, right, so it's this, this, it's this part. If I could kind of, if I could start my attempts like just after this part here, like it would be so different, wouldn't it? Like if I could start the attempts after like this whole source section, it would be very different. Right, let's be careful here. Let's do a, a big jump and spin. There we go. I didn't mess up that one and I didn't mess up that one either. That's very good. This is very promising. This is where I messed up last time though. So let's be really careful. And there we go. I made my way to this platform here. Let's try and at least get past one of them. Oh no, I could have made it past that one, but I just hit it at the end. But there we go. I made it past this one. This is good. So this means that I don't need to go for that really tricky mushroom on that next section. Let's just make sure I land in the pipe first. There we go. That that's always harder than it looks. I've only failed that attempt, uh, that jump once. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, it's much harder than it looks. So I want to be quick here so I can get. Oh no, that wasn't good. But there we go. I made it to here. The Goomba is coming. Remember the Goomba. Is the Goomba coming? Okay, the Goomba is not coming. We're okay. <laughs> right. Let's go and uh, let's throw him down there. And I'm about to get the fire flower, and then I'm all kind of back to, to peak condition. So it'd be lovely to make it through this section without getting absolutely destroyed. Because every time I go through here, I always get hit by everything. And this section, it looks very doable. It, look, it looks very possible to be able to, to complete. I don't know what it is uh, that's making me uh, kind of keep failing it. Uh, so I got hit once there. Let's make it across. There we go. So that was good. I made it to, to here. And uh, I only got... Oh, okay. Don't get hit again. Don't get hit again. Yeah. So I made it to here. And I'm still big at this point. Okay. And I think every other time... So I want to be really careful to not hit the, um, uh, the, okay, we'll steady on, steady on. Right, I kind of completely forgot about this section. I kind of thought we were already on to the next section. I kind of completely forgot about this, but I never really, uh, failed at this bit too much, though. This, oh no, no, why did I say that? Why did I say I've never failed at this bit? I was really scared because you can see the way they, um, the way there's that magic, and uh, not the magic, the, the music block there, is designed to push you into one of the, um, uh, the, uh, the, the boxes that's gonna send out all of the booze. And I was trying to really avoid that, and then that's what made me fail. That was a really nice attempt, though. That was, that was pretty smooth. That was definitely the, um, the best attempts I've had up until that point. I just, I just need to get past that next bit. I'm down to five lives left. This is the, the five Mario challenge at this point here. So <laughs> things are gonna get really tough. I'm starting now to, I think this is the first time where I'm thinking it's much more unlikely that I'm gonna not complete it uh, than going to complete it. Like I must be honest, I've been quietly confident that I would eventually be able to, to complete it. Uh, the way I've just been gradually uh, improving. I have been, uh, I have been starting to think that, you know, I'm gonna make it. 
I'm, I'm starting to think it's going to be really tough, but I am eventually going to make it. And now I'm starting to, now I'm starting to kind of think in the opposite direction, if I'm honest with you. And oh no, and things like that. See, that's the thing. It's just those, it's not the bigger, it's not the attempts where you get really far, but then fail. It's all of the little like failed attempts that you have in the middle that just waste those lives. That's what's, that's what's really going to lose it for me in the end. But there we go. That was good there. If I can nail this one, then there we go. That was good. I'm getting I'm getting much better at doing them uh, than I was uh, before. All oh, got to be careful there. Let's not muck this one up. There we go. So this means I don't need to go for that uh, uh, the mushroom down there, which just makes this section way easier. Let's go and jump here. Let's spin. Okay, I got hurt, but that's okay. So I can make my way up to here. Careful of the Goomba. No, I even remembered it. I was even thinking to avoid it, but it's still, it just drops so suddenly. For, for an enemy with wings, it drops down very quickly. Four attempts left. We're going right down to the Y with this one. Oh, I can't. Ah. Oh. I don't know. I don't. I don't know how you're handling this because I'm tense playing this and watching it, thinking, "Am I gonna make it or not?" If I get down to the final attempt, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be sweating. I'm gonna be panicking. I might just for the final attempt. Should I just go silent? Because I know I say this a lot, and like every YouTuber says this, playing the game while talking is infinitely more difficult than playing and just concentrating. Because like I'm concentrating almost more on what I'm saying than what I'm doing, if that makes sense. Like, I don't know if you believe me, but like, it, I don't know if you realize just how big of a difference it makes when you're trying to, to speak at the, the same time, but it's huge. It, you know, it, it's, I'm like, I'm putting half of my brain power to playing and the other half to to speaking. So just imagine imagine what I could do if I put all of my brain power to, to just playing the game. <laughs> it does actually make uh, a huge difference. So I don't know. I think that I might, I might do that. As boring as it might be, if I get down to the final attempt, I might just go silent. I might just go completely silent and just play because I think that might be necessary in order to, to complete it. But for now, uh, hopefully it's not going to get down to that because if I do, it's going to be so stressful. <laughs> I think it would be lovely just to, to complete it now. And look at that, actually, while I've just been chatting away, I'm having a I'm having a pretty nice run here. This has been this has been very good. I don't think I've ever got to this point while still having the uh, the fire flower. So so that's pretty good. Let's try and make my way down here. Okay, I've lost the um I've lost the fire flower. But look, I'm still big at this point. So even if that Goomba does get me it won't matter too much let's go and deal with him let's fire this guy that way and i can go up on the vine and i can now go and get the other fire flower a very good run probably to this point and i don't want to jinx it but probably to this point the best run yet would you agree i think so right so i want to time it so you see that fire going up and down i want to jump now then i want to get to that oh no 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 i jinxed it <laughs> Okay, whatever. <laughs> every every now and then when you fall and die, it just plays really weird sound effects and it plays for ages. I just want to listen to it for a little bit, but I've, I've heard it before. Right then, three attempts left. Three attempts. Okay, this is... Forget, forget the final attempt. This is this is pretty tense already. Right, that was, a prom that was a promising run there. It was a stupid failure. So what I think I'm going to do is if I still have the fire flower at that point... I might not worry about doing what I tried to do, like jump on those boxes, because I think it's better to, to take the hits and play it safe, because if, if I drop off the map, no matter how like big I am or if I have a fire flower, like I'm done. But if I, if I get hit by an enemy, like it just hurts me a little bit. So I think the safe way to do that section is to, it's just to take some hits, you know, just to get hurt, you know, just accept that I'm going to get hurt a little bit. You know, but just kind of carry on going anyway. Right, let's go like this. I want to stay at the very front. There we go. And I want to stay in the middle of these two. Okay, that was a little bit close for comfort, but I was able to, to make it. So let's try and do this section well. There we go. I avoided the first one. I always like avoiding that first one. That second one's probably the uh, the easiest out of the uh, the lot. And uh, now these are the these are the really tricky ones. Uh, all I want to do is try and get a uh, try and get over at least one of them. And there's the second one. Oh, look at that! A perfect run. Look, see how good I'm getting. See how good I am getting at this now. All right, let's go and uh, let's not muck up the uh, the easy section here. Getting on the uh, the pipe and uh, let's go and keep going. So now I still have the fire flower. This is this is very promising. I keep jumping too early. Oh look, I can. I, I didn't think about this. Why have I not been thinking about shooting the fire flower? I constantly have the fire flower, <laughs> but I kind of I kind of forget the fact that you know the fire flower shoots fire. That's kind of the uh, the point of it. But I kind of keep ignoring that. But it doesn't matter. So I'm gonna get a um a brand new fire flower here. So let's let's just not 
like jump as much. Let's not worry about jumping on top of those spinny blocks. Just let's just play it the safe way and let's just kind of take the uh, the hits that I'm going to take. So I'm going to get hurt here, but that's fine because I can now go and jump to the end and I made it. Okay, so I didn't make it without getting hit at all, but I still made it nonetheless. And that is uh, that is better than not making it at all. So let's wait here for a second for that platform to, to jump. I kind of want to stare at that boo there so he doesn't go after me. Let's turn around behind again and uh, look at him there. And uh, this is this is where I failed last time, isn't it? Where I got this far. Okay, this is good. That boo's still like, let's try and control where that boo's looking. So let's look at him there. And I want to be really quick. Oh, okay. That was a little bit scary. Okay, I can still, oh no, no. I tried to jump down to the bottom one, but I jumped just a second too late and I ran off the edge. Two attempts left, right. This is, this is the last talkie attempt, okay? This is gonna be the last time I commentate playing this level. Oh, this is so tense. I keep doing so well, don't I? I keep doing really well and then failing just at the last section. Whichever YouTubers would just upload this whole thing either. <laughs> I get like, cause everyone does like montages. Everyone does like fail montages and they're fine. Cause it's kind of just like the highlight funny moments. But I feel like, I feel like recording and uploading it all, you kind of go on the, you're on the full journey with me. You have experienced everything that I've experienced. And so the, the successes and the, uh, the failures, I feel like they just kind of mean more. You know, when you've been through uh, absolutely uh, everything. All right, let's go and do this bit. Oh, that was good. I, I always like avoiding that section. So let's wait. Let's wait for just uh, a second here. And then let's go here. Then hopefully I can just avoid them too. There we go. This is good. I want to stand in like the middle here and then avoid them. Okay, that was good. I'm kind of I'm kind of also taking notes for the uh, the final attempt here. Let's avoid that. There we go. That was uh, jolly good and avoid this one. Okay. Okay, good. We've got to, to this point uh, pretty successfully. I have failed that jump before. I want to I just want to have full concentration on everything I'm doing. There we go. That was nicely done. And there we go. That one wasn't that uh, wasn't as nicely done, but it's okay. I'm still alive cuz I was going to use the um the fire flower to shoot those piranha plants. But to be honest, this this section isn't really the part that worries me uh, quite so much anymore. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of getting a little bit better at it, so I'm not worrying about it too much. Oh, look, there we go. I was able to avoid getting hit. I want to avoid the. Oh, okay, steady, steady. Okay, hello, hello, hello. All right, let's just throw the uh, let's just throw that shell at the the goomba. <laughs> let's not even uh, try and get close to him. And I might just wait here a little bit, and I might wait for that guy to pass because there's that giant guy who's flying across to the right of the screen now, and he's taken me out before. And so I think it might be worth just waiting here just for a second, just so he can leave. Just so he can go and leave off the other side of the screen, and then no matter what happens, I don't need to worry about it too much. So now, I want to go like this, and I'm gonna do the, the same again. Well, actually, let's try and jump to here, and then there we go, I made it down. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hopefully stay at least big. Okay, so I'm not, I haven't got the fire flower, but at least I'm, uh, I'm large at this section, uh, which should help me out for this bit here. So let's look at that boo. Then I want to stay just staring at that boo there, because uh, I don't want him. Uh, I don't want him causing any trouble uh, with me in a little bit. So let's stay there, and then let's jump across here. Okay. That part was done there. I now need to control where this boo is. So I want to go and get this uh, this P button. And I want to make sure I'm, oh, I'm really scared here. I want to drop it down just there and then jump up. Okay, I got hit, but that's okay. I can now go and jump up here. Jump up here. I got plenty of time, plenty of time, plenty of time. Ignore the scary music. And I've made my way to here. Okay, there's a mushroom there. I'm going to wait for this mushroom to make its way back. And I can grab the mushroom. I can now jump on here. And uh, what's this firing out? I didn't see. Was that firing boos out, I think, maybe? All right, let's go and take out this guy again. I can keep the uh, the boo here and then I can jump and uh, oh no oh no okay not not good not good but it's okay it's okay I'm still I'm still alive I'm still alive this is I've only got one more attempt after this but I'm still alive and that's what matters <laughs> right let's go and jump like this and then okay oh no I missed that okay I made it up to here so now I think I need to jump off the uh, the dead bone and then to the other side which is going to be easy just like that and oh no <laughs> okay I'm going silent. This is the final attempt. Wish me luck, everyone. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
I guess I can't blame you for making me need to speak then. So is that it then? That's it. I failed. Oh no! Admit it. That was that was very tense at the end there. I was like overthinking every single button press that I made. Then I was trying to be so careful and calculated. But I just basically got to a bit that I didn't know, and I just didn't know what to do. Ah oh, dear. Okay, so there we go. That is the 100 Mario Challenge Expert Edition. Should I just start again right away? No, I think I think I need to not look at Mario for like a month. So I haven't given up on the 100 Mario Challenge Expert. I will be trying it again in the future. I do need to take a bit of a break though. I think you probably need a bit of a break as well. So I want to say thank you so much for, for watching the video to this point. And if you skipped ahead in the video just to see the way it was going to end, then shame on you. <laughs> Only joking. Thanks for watching anyway. So yeah, there will be more Mario Maker coming up soon. Uh, well, I will attempt the uh, the challenge again, but I will have a, a little bit of a break. Uh, but yeah, all of my other normal videos are going to be carrying on. Uh, yeah, so uh, you'll certainly have something to, to watch. Uh, anyway, that is the end of this episode here. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye!